hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's z again with another interesting video for you if you're new here please like subscribe share you know what to do and if you're not new thanks for coming back and tuning into this video and let's get right into it so you're right correctly we are finally going to be doing a huge shein haul this is actually the first time i've ordered clothes from shein and i know i'm a bit late on the trend okay but i finally hopped onto the trend and i decided to order some clothes from shein to show you guys the pieces i ordered and i have a lot of stuff to try on for you guys like i'm trying to get a good thumbnail <laughs> Oh my days. Um, so I know that you guys, okay, stuff has fallen on the floor, but let's not mind that. So I know obviously some of you guys may have questions about how to order stuff from Sheen and that kind of thing. So I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave all the details down below in my description box, but I will give you guys a little like guide at the end of this haul so you guys can know how to order clothes from Sheen and that kind of thing. Because as you all know, I live in Zambia and Zambia isn't particularly one of the most privileged countries when it comes to ordering clothes online so i'll give you guys all the loopholes and everything i use to get my stuff quickly and that kind of thing but yeah so let's get right into this haul shall we i know my setup is different because i'm at home so i decided to put my i had my stuff shipped to my home address in kitwe hence why i'm at home right now but i was like yeah this would be like a great place to film so let's begin so the first items on the i'm going to start by doing tops and then we'll go into bottoms then dresses and then like hoodies throwovers and then going to shoes and accessories last so that's kind of how much stuff i ordered i got like quite a bunch of stuff but yeah so the first items on the on the in the hall that i got was this really nice ribbed um crop top i love this top so much i it's so comfortable and you guys the thing is in clothes i was sort of a bit like scared because i'm quite small like i'm not small but like i'm quite small you guys have seen my body type so I was kind of scared. I didn't want the stuff to be like too big or too small. So this is a size XS. This is a ribbed crop top. I'm going to leave all the details in my description box down below so you guys can check out exactly what I ordered. Hopefully they haven't sold up because she in stuff sold up really, really fast. So yeah, this is the first top I got. It's a crop top-ish because it ends like here. And I don't really have a big bust, but I like how it holds my boobs and then like, yeah, so it's like really, really nice. The next item I got was, is this oversized graphic tee. You all know all about the graphic tees and I love the print at the back. That's, that's, that's fire. And in front as well, because I kind of really like this font. But what I will say is that I kind of don't really like the material. In the picture, I'll put it somewhere up here. The material looks very like heavy cotton this is more of like that light cotton it does stretch a bit and because it's oversized you know it would be really good if the material wasn't so like flowy because like look at how big this is but it would look cute on a pair of biker shorts that's for sure and i love the print it's like really really oversized i think you guys can see but like i love my shirts oversized because i can like tie them you know it would be like cute and everything so I got this in a size extra large because I love like big clothes and one thing about Shein is I've noticed that their clothes are naturally like a big fit because even um, the top I'm just from showing you guys, I got it in a size XS but when I buy clothes like in Zambia size XS most of the time they're actually like really really tight but that one even someone who wears medium can fit in so that's kind of why I went for that. Well, this one but i really love it so much i just probably don't turn this into like a pajama because i've got a bad habit of turning my graphic tees into pajamas but i love this so much i love what what really attracted me is the print at the back like i really love the print at the back it's like so cute i got it in a size xl <laughs> for a turtleneck that is black and long sleeved and not open at the back girl Purr. but yeah so this is the third the third top i got is this really really cute turtleneck 
and bro like let's get into the material like this is original spandex okay i really love this so much especially because you know like it gets really cold like in the cold season and that kind of thing so this isn't really like a particular season clothing haul it's more of my everyday style because this is, this is the type of thing that i wear like every day there's not really like a particular yeah but i got this in a size xs i'll leave the exact names of everything i got in the description box down below because she in the goodness of she in is that they offer so many different alternatives to clothes that you may want so even if something may be sold out trust me there's always another thing available like i was so impressed with like how to shop and everything so yeah so this is size xs this is like super cute you guys like oh my gosh yeah and i love the fact that it's not really like it's not too long so i can actually wear it like as a cropped you know like i don't have tacky tin because it like still looks good either way it fits perfectly and i love the fact that it's sort of like a layered you know collar teutonic sort of thingy so it's not i don't really have to worry about it like getting too stretchy and that kind of thing so yeah the camera for this one because it's a dress so this is the fourth thing i got my boyfriend actually picked this dress i was remember telling you that i'm going to like diversify my wardrobe and everything so i got this really nice like get into this dress you guys like oh my gosh i think what i love the most about it is the fact that it has a slit like right down my right thigh and then it's like really nice and long like i can wear this literally like out for drinks or that kind of thing it's like a really nice and casual dress and i love it so much i got this in a size extra small i'm actually like quite scared because like i said the way my clothes fit me it depends on what exactly i'm buying so if it's body fitting i'll get xs or s but if i want it to be like oversized i get like l xl i never buy medium size clothes because they're kind of like a weird fit on my body like do you want to be big do you want to be small but like this is the i think fourth item i got it really does bring out my girl oh like a really fire dress like honestly if you all see me taking these dresses just know my boyfriend put me on her this is like really nice i love this i'm actually like so in love with it i was a bit skeptical about it i'm not going to lie when i was getting it but i really do love it so much so yeah like i said size extra small The next items I got are these sweatpants. They're actually the one that I started the video with. And bro, when I tell you I'm in love with them, I am obsessed with them. So I got this in a size S because I wanted sort of like a loose fit, but I didn't want to upsize too much because of my waist. As you guys can see, they have no strings, but they are still like really fire. And they have like a really nice and loose fit at the bottom. Like I do dig that. The only concern I have with these is the fact that they don't have any pockets. It's sort of like a bummer because I really love pockets in my sweatpants, but otherwise they are really comfortable, really soft. So I got these in grey, in a size S, in black. So they actually came as a set together. So they paired, so the colors I chose were grey and black because I really needed a, like a different um, set of sweatpants and everything. The black ones don't really look as good as the grey ones did, in my opinion. They look a little bit like the material isn't really like the best. I don't know if you guys can see, it's like this really stretchy material, but they're comfortable otherwise and they're so cute. I know I'm going to rock these somehow. So you guys can see like the bralette I'm wearing is like a really dark black, but then this is like a sort of like a lightish black. Not really like completely black, but it's good. It's good. Okay, so the next item I got is this really oversized flannel. Like if you know me, you know I have been looking all over Lusaka for flannel like this. I haven't buttoned the buttons because I'm I, I currently have my nails on and it's kind of hard to do that. But this is the flat guys. I love this so much. Like I love oversized clothing. Like I think you guys have noticed. I love pairing like um you know 
tight fitting things with like oversized because this like with like a nice tank top and like some biker shorts or even like sweatpants and everything would look like so fire and i love this so much i love the design like this is the basic flannel design and i really wanted to try out one before getting i was going to get like three of these you guys and i was like no let me just like relax so as usual when it's oversized i get in a size x because i wanted to like fit like this like extra large i think you guys can tell that and i love this material don't know where you guys can see it's not really it's not that cheap material it's like the really really nice material and everything and it's like so good you guys like i love this i love this like I'm obsessed okay I kind of to take some good pictures you know on the gram so you're better following me on Instagram for all the updates on how I'm going to style these clothes I didn't really want to like a lookbook I was sort of like going for just showing you guys the clothes as opposed to me styling them but if you guys want more videos of me like actually styling my clothes and everything I'll give them to you because on this channel we do everything from cooking to vlogs to now clothing hauls okay okay so this is the flannel I got it in a size extra large and I'm obsessed like you can add a button it up, but I think kind of looks better when you like leave it open, so. Yo, guys, tell me why I love oversized clothing. So the next item I've got was this really nice hoodie and wait for it, but guys, you know, like it looks plain from the front, eh? Like, okay, it's just the hoodie, cool. But then the graphics at the back, and fun fact, I don't like, I hate the color red, okay? I hate the color blue, but I think even sometimes I'm trying to incorporate like some color in the clothes I was getting because most of the time I wear like very neutral colors, black, brown, nude, white, you know, gray, and that kind of thing. But one thing that really attracted me to this hoodie was the bag and i know it's white so this is not something to wear every day because i don't want it to obviously like turn brown or anything but i really like this hoodie is everything it has the the pockets obviously and then it has this is honestly like the best part about the hoodie is the back like i just love the back the material is also good it's a one very good cotton and this stuff was this is actually like very cheap you know so like i'm really impressed of course not some of the things i don't really like that much but like overall i'm very impressed so as usual i got this in a size xl I wanted it to be like a really huge loose fit on some damaged jeans and my yeezys i'm going to be going to class looking oh <laughs> these are clothes that I can actually wear to class. I wanted to get stuff that I don't necessarily have to restrict to like going out. So these are campus clothes, but like this is how I dress up on almost every day. size 38 uk so basically the sheet in sizes they give the sizes in like different um country formats of course i'm from zambia so i follow the uk one obviously which is size 38 uk but that's like size five she's at five and a half but i think no, it's yeah a size 38 it's written on the book like size 38 and stuff so yeah i don't i don't know what color this is if I'm being completely honest, but it's like a really nice brown and I love them so much. They are comfortable to walk in and the heel isn't too high because you all know I can't walk in heels, I just use them for the picture. So, yeah. I can't show you guys the other dress I got because that's actually my 19th birthday dress. And you're probably wondering, like, why did I order my birthday clothes early this year? If you know me and you watched my birthday vlog last year, you will know that I stressed out a lot. 
and I wasn't going to show you guys the heels because these are the heels I'm wearing for my 19th birthday but I was like why not because I think if you follow me on Instagram I posted them on my Instagram story so everyone's like oh my gosh these are so cute so I don't really mind you guys seeing the heels but the dress you all will see it in September September 25th and I tried to get the everything now because I don't want to stress out during that period I'm a full-time ACCA student I don't want to like you know be stressed out but yeah so the last item I got is this really cute phone cover and like I know you're probably wondering like why is phone cover guys let me tell you something if you have enough patience you don't have to pay 100 kwacha 200 kwacha to get your phone covers from these stores I'm not trying to bring on their business but like it's way cheaper to get them for 75 pounds as in 0 0.75 wait no for 75 cents off the side because it's like really cute so my phone's an XR so here's why I got this and I love I love the sides like look at that it's a mirror phone cover like I can take a picture of this bro so I just took a picture for the gram just put it on my story as a teaser just so people can kind of like see what's happening and you guys like I really do love this phone case so much I've been in need of a phone for uh, speak I've been in need of a phone case for a very long time so I actually do dig this it's a mirror case so you guys can like literally see where yours at on my ring light um but like I dig this so much it's so cute and I love the fact that it has like this um side and everything so yeah my phone's an xr so that's why i got this case but there's really like so many cases for you to choose from and i love the mirror effect that's the reason why i like got it so yeah that's basically all the stuff i got from shein <laughs> Closing haul. Make sure you guys let me know that you want some more of these holes and I'll be sure to give them to you. This year I thought I was going to diversify my content and that's coming in with everything. Cooking series, vlogs, clothing hauls, reviews, get ready with me. Like literally we'll be doing everything on this channel this year. So yeah, I jumped in, I jumped into this shirt because like as you know, like I'm at home and I'm going back to school on like um Monday. But before we end the video, let me just give you guys like a breakdown of how to order clothes from Shein. I know the angle has changed so much. I'm so sorry about that. I was just trying to find an angle that like fits perfectly. Um, but yeah, so basically, I'm going to kind of like leave a screen recording on the side here just to show you guys how I ordered my stuff. So basically, download the app from the App Store, either the App Store or Google Play Store, Shein, right? And then you change the region. This is particularly for people that are ordering clothes from Zambia because I'm from Zambia so I know it can be like quite tricky on ordering clothes and whatnot so yeah so change the region in UK that's the region from which it's being shipped not to where it's going I remember I posted, I posted on my story like a step by step with how to order clothes from Shein because I know not a lot of people tell you guys like not a lot of people tell people like how to order clothes online you just see them buying and say no yeah I paid for it but like I literally posted like a step by step with ordering clothes from Shein on my Instagram story so if you're not following me on Instagram better follow me on Instagram because I literally put all the tea to help you guys make it easy for you guys to order the stuff and whatnot so yeah so what happened is when i ordered when i changed it to uk obviously the stuff's coming to zambia so i put my zambian address my home address not my school address because my school wasn't among the possible shipping addresses if that makes sense so i put my home address and that's why i came home this particular weekend because i knew my clothes were going to be here when i got here so after doing that obviously like i added stuff to my cart and that kind of thing and then after adding everything to my cart I paid using my card obviously I have a debit card so I paid using my debit card and then because it's coming to Zambia I had to I had to pay for some freight charges because it was coming to Zambia so there's sort of like a little increment in the prices of the clothes but it wasn't really that significant I think aggregated should have been like two to three pounds but then because I was ordering stuff I think I ordered stuff where I think 150 pounds will not be mistaken and to that's right you can do the math multiply by 25 that's a lot of money so 
because I ordered stuff over 120 pounds, I was eligible for free express shipping. So I didn't have to pay for shipping. I only had to pay for the shipping guarantee, which is I think 0 0.75 pounds. So I was paying for my stuff in pounds using my card. And I think, I feel like, because when I asked people, you know, that before I was ordering my clothes, I asked people like how they did and everything like that. And most people said it's more convenient from she in UK as opposed to she in US. Because I think if you have had stuff shipped to Zambia from the US, it takes two months literally because like when i received my packages last year for my skincare items i had them i actually like got them in like june but they only got here in august but like from she in uk because it was free express shipping i ordered my stuff on the 25th of february and my stuff was here on the 11th of march so approximately two weeks which is 10 working days because they only ship on the working days and the goodness is that they actually do give you like um they help you like you literally are able to see how your par parcel is moving so i literally saw like it was from china then it went to dubai then south africa then it came to zambia so literally like the day i was coming back home was on a thursday it was in osaka and it had been dispatched to get it so on friday yesterday at i think around 14 30 the package was on my dining room table so i was like really happy and everything so yeah so that's basically how i ordered the stuff from Shein. if you've got any other questions feel free to ask in the comment section down below and i'll be happy to answer them when i can and of course i will leave the exact links to what i bought in the description box down below but please don't first of all this isn't a sponsored video so i used my money so she if you're watching this feel free to sponsor me because like i spent quite a lot of coins and um also note that some of the things that i may post may be sold out because literally like she in stuff sold out really fast so i may have bought some that may have been sold out but there's always like alternatives they always post like alternatives so yeah but otherwise i will see you guys again in my video next week don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and come back next week for another banger let me know how you like this video and i'm sure to give you guys more she in hauls this year because like she in is the most affordable online store ever come across so yeah love you guys so much thank you guys for watching Mwah. bye Thank you.